I wanted to tell you the story about my first ever bike packing trip and how it didn't really go quite as I was expecting it to. It took place last summer over two really, really hot days, and before the trip itself I'd done quite a lot of planning and preparation. As part of that preparation I watched an awful lot of YouTube videos, and one in particular by Agnishka from Wheels on a Bike had a few bits of information that I really took to heart. As far as the equipment I took and how I organised it was concerned, I think I did really pretty well. One thing that Agnishka said was, don't overestimate the distance that you're going to cycle on your first ever bikepacking trip, and so I chose to do just 70 kilometers. But I chose a route that was full of hills and a lot of gravel. And the other thing was that I was so focused in on my destination that I just plowed on straight through, pushing quite hard, not stopping for enough water, and definitely not eating enough. This was one of the rare occasions I actually stopped to look around me. When I arrived at the campground, I was so exhausted that I could barely speak. And don't ask me what I was doing here. So I'm glad I didn't um do much more than that. It's just as well I used the time lapse feature here. In reality, I was so exhausted that this took so long and it really would have taken up way too much space in this video. Despite being exhausted, the bike ride was really, really awesome. And I so enjoyed camping. It's the first time I've really done this since I was a kid. The reason why this trip wasn't as I expected was because I was kind of hoping to put together a really good informative video for, for you. And in the end, I could barely string a sentence together, let alone come out with witty and insightful comments and bits of advice. It's not the best I've ever had, but um, it does the job. I actually slept uh, really well last night. It was um, it was dead quiet around here. Not a not a single animal noise or anything apart from at one point uh, I had chipmunks or squirrels or something uh, attacking some stuff that I'd left out on the picnic table. So I had to get up and uh, go and drag all of that in here. So I've got. Up masses of stuff surrounding me which is a bit of a mess but um, no I was very comfortable and I've probably got about seven hours of, of solid sleep so I'm happy good start to the day from pushing myself way too hard and then having to try to recover sitting in the sweltering heat in that campground for a, a couple of hours. Apart from that, this was a fantastic trip. It has me really excited about the prospect of doing more bikepacking trips in 2022. And maybe on the next trip that I take, I'll try 
try not to lose the power of speech. If you're going to be bikepacking for the first time ever in 2022, then please feel free to learn from my mistakes. Don't push too hard, make sure you fuel properly, and above all, just enjoy the journey. Mm -hmm.